Hey people, Duncan here. I'm going to take a second and I want to talk about how liberal politics in Oregon affects our pocketbooks. So, first and foremost though, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Like the videos, comment in the box below, and hit that bell for notifications. So let's talk about how liberal politics affects our bankroll our pocketbook and our bills okay so for, I got my power bill the other day and I'm looking at all these new charges I want to go over a few of them with you okay so first and foremost they're saying that the basic charge for a single place for a single phase delivery charge okay your basic delivery charge is nine dollars fifty cents delivery charge is sixty three dollars and thirty cents now supply energy because I live in a one-bedroom apartment and it's got two streets on it and we have a street light okay they're charging me twice for it and the first time is sixteen dollars and sixty two cents plus forty six dollars and two cents and then the second time they charged me for it because they charged me twice because it's on two roads is again six dollars and thirty seven cents and then seventeen dollars and thirty nine cents now the public purpose charge is four dollars and seventy seven cents the energy conversation com, com, uh, the energy conserva, cons, conservation charge excuse me for the last nine days is a dollar thirty one and for the last twenty five days it's three dollars and eighty five cents now the low income assistance tax for eight days is 16 cents and for 26 days is 64 cents and it keeps going this list continues to the backside now the JC Boyle dam removal something that most of Oregon voted no on but Portland liberal Portland voted yes on so now we every county in Oregon is paying 54 cents to every bill for a dam removal that we didn't want to pay for. Next is the Capco and Iron Gate dam removal. Another project we all failed, um, but somehow Portland passed it, and now we all pay an extra dollar sixty-nine for it per month on our bill. Now the AP or the APA. Columbia River benefits for 34 days. Okay, they're giving us a credit of $11.86. Now, the Klamath Falls City Utilities Tax is $5.33. And the and then there's a $2.67 charge for a grand total of $168. And 20 cents for new charges okay that's your liberal politics a hundred and sixty eight dollars that they're charging me for dam removals for light posts outside on the street for power boxes for delivery charges as well as the utilities, the electricity that I use. My bill in this apartment is almost $200 a month, easy, for a one-bedroom apartment. And it's because of all these liberal politics that are nickeling and diming us to death. This is one bill. Now imagine you have to pay rent, electricity, car payments, insurance, health insurance, 
You have to pay all these different bills to go with it. And you wonder why Oregon is a poor state. You wonder why there's so many people in poverty. So many people living off benefits. HUD. Because it's easier to go live off of the system than to work and to try to pay your bills. They're making it nearly impossible to experience economic freedom. And that's the fact. Stand up, question things, look at things. See how this is? Literally, they're charging us for three dam removals on one bill. Our bill has gone up almost 50 bucks the first of this year because of politics. Politics that much of Oregon voted no for. But the liberal city of Portland voted yes because it doesn't affect them. Wake up, Oregon. Up. Um, we have to do something before we're taxed in the submission. Before we're bankrupt. We need somebody in office that's going to work to protect our economic freedom as Americans, as Oregonians. We cannot allow liberal left Kate Brown or any other politician that is going to continue bleeding us. We must stop the bleeding. Help me redeem Oregon. Pass the message. Tell everybody to wake up. Push a candidates to speak for us. To hear our voice and to represent us as Americans. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Um, God bless. If you like this video, please like, hit the comment button. If you have anything to say, hit that bell for more, to more notifications. And uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Thank you for watching. Peace. Duncan out.